Okay, so check this out, huh? We made it to the second pier. It is looking pretty good out here, I ain't gonna lie. Beautiful view all the way from the end of Fort De Soto. A lot of grass on top of the water. And I gotta tell you something, we gotta take a little lunch break right now. But according to my Uber driver, the dude who drove us down here, if you cast straight from the end of the spear, according to the Uber driver, okay, it is 110 feet, which of course I don't believe, right? So, anyways, we're gonna we're gonna get some stuff to eat right now. After we eat, we're gonna get the rods all set up again. Multi-species is going to continue. We are at 48 species today so far. Hopefully, over here the species are going to change a little bit, okay? After all, this pier is the closest pier to the Gulf waters that we have here, right? So stay tuned, it should be good. Mm-hmm. Mm. Mm First bite of the day, my man. His bait coming up. Old bait is definitely coming up. New pier, new bait. Definitely not 40 feet down here, man. Someone said, oh, it's 40 feet. Same bait, pinkfish. Which is not bad, which is not bad, you know. Got two pinkfish on the sabiki rig. We're gonna live line the smallest one of two. Uh, this one here. And we'll see if we'll catch anything on it. Damn, son. We got one, two, three, four, five here. Just waiting for the pink fish, man. These birds, they need to learn, man, how to catch their own fish. <laughs> oh, my dad is too much, man. Nossa! Oh, my dad says a fish. What the heck? Shomo yan da yue. The heck did my dad catch here? And how he's gonna bring this fish up? Oh, that's why it's a skate, man. Some kind of weird ass skate. Oh, 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 easy bird! Are you kidding me, dude? That's a skate, dude. You can eat the skate. Get the hell out of there, birds. Are you kidding me? Yo, these birds, man. Ah, check this out. Huh? We got a beautiful little skate. Another species here, huh? Uh, looks like a clear nose skate. Got the markings on top here. Little Kohaja species, genus. Yeah, but this one's got a black dot on top of its face, though. So we are fishing right here at the end of the pier. Birds are going a little bit crazy on us. And I don't know how the footage of our last catch turned out to be because I just changed the memory card. But my dad actually just landed some type of skate, what I believe to be a clear nose skate, although it had a really uh, interesting marking on top of it, a black mark right between its eyes, right? So we are at 49 different species for our Florida Slam so far. We only need one more, one new one to make it 50. That is pretty impressive. But anyways, we gotta keep fishing, see what else shows up today. Oh, my dad said it's a new species, man. Is that number 50 for today? He said it's some type of shark. Oh yeah, 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 it's a little type of shark. Because uh, it's the old one. That's the same species as the one he just caught, a little bone it had. Man, my dad's killing you today with the little sharks, man. Look at that, another little bone it had, man. I've been trying to catch one on the cut bait, and he's been landing then on shrimp or something. Crazy, guys, this is crazy. Alrighty, final view of our little bonnet head right here. Check that out, man. Super feisty. Look at that. I really don't want my dad to handle these, you know. I don't want him to lose a finger like my brother, like my brother-in-law did with the bluefish. So there it goes. 
Oh, nice. Little clear nose skate. Poison? No, no poison. Just gotta be careful with the with the spikes here at the yeah, tail. Yeah, yeah. But uh, no poison. Yeah, but it has a poison on the. Oh no, this is different. Tail, yeah? No, no, this is this is not a ray. This is a skate. Uh -huh. So yeah, you see, like like this is okay. It's, it's all fine. Yeah. Because the, yeah, this is not a ray. This is a skate. Has a, something on the net. Yeah, yeah. Like that? that that is the ray. This oh, is okay. the skate. Oh, okay. Yeah, so the skate just gotta be careful at the back here. It's got the spines, but no poison. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, all right. Just make sure to take the hook out. It'll be good. I don't think I can do it. <laughs> oh, there he goes. What? Oh, 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 oh. It's on, it's on, it's on, it's on, it's on. Let go. What the hell, man? Oh, come on, get it, boy. Give up. What's the deal? Too small, man. Oh, it's on. It's on. It's a small, but it's on. It's very small, actually. <laughs> Man, even this one got to the hook, huh? That was a pretty big hook, too. Whatever this guy is, little shark. So, I will leave the identification of this dude for later. I am almost positive this is a black tip shark, but you just never know. It may be a young, juvenile, Atlantic sharp nose. So, I took a few photos. Needless to say, this is a species number 50 of our Florida's lamb. It's going good today. But yeah, this one here is pretty much ready to go. Oh, that's a big one. A little, not a little shark. Are you kidding me? Dude, if it is another bonehead head, I'm gonna be pissed. Cause all I've landed today is the Atlantic sharp nose, and my dad already landed two bonehead heads, which I don't have on my species list yet. Oh, you got to be kidding! It's another bonehead head, man. What the heck, man? My dad just said you caught zero, I caught three. Savage, man. Look at this. Are you for real, dude? This is what I'm looking for. Look how small this is. I caught two Atlantic sharp nose already. I can't even seem to catch one of these, man. On the shrimp too. Ah, <sighs> found All right, man, let me just quickly unhook here. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, easy, buddy. <laughs> easy, dude, don't throw up on me, all right, man? Dude, he's throwing up the whole stomach here, dude. Are you for real, dude, dude, dude? Oh, okay, 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 just, just go back. Just go back, all right, man, go back. Dude, look at this, man! The whole meal here, little crab! Little crab, little, little everything here, oh my goodness! Oh, that's a, that's a new species right here, boys! What is this? Is there teeth in the front? If there's no teeth in front, it's an American silver perch. Yeah, this is an American silver perch. Look at that. Species number 51 of our trip. Check this out, huh? So final view of our American silver perch that my dad just caught. We're running out on cut bait, you know, because the shark, they've been taking all the cut bait. So time to give this guy the one rod special. All right, there it goes. It's cut bait now. Good cut bait. Let's see, let's see. Oh yeah, one rod special, never fails to disappoint. Oh damn son, we got something here. Is it a bonehead head? Doesn't feel like it. Certainly hope it is, but what the heck is that? Yo, dude, this is a new species for me regardless. Check this out. <laughs> it's one of those saltwater catfish. That you just can't afford to be stung by it, yeah? I think this is a gaff top sail catfish. 
needless to say, this is a species 195 for me. Dude, I'm afraid of touching this thing, man, because I know if I get stung, it's gonna hurt the hell out of me, man. All right, let's take it easy with this guy. It's my first time handling one of these. I know they got one spine on the dorsal, two on the pectoral, and I do not want to get spined. Holy cow, hell yeah, look at this, dude. My name is Leo Shang. We're about to enter the sting zone with the gaff top sail catfish. <laughs> no way, look at this. Coyote Peterson may be able to do it, not me, man. But anyways, let's just unhook this guy, let, take a quick photo and release it, yeah? All right, we gotta be very careful with the release of this guy, the gaff top sail catfish, I believe. Uh, make sure he doesn't sting me. The birds are waiting for it already. I don't think they can eat this fish, but uh, we'll see, let's see. Oh, dude, it got him. Oh my goodness. Oh no, it, it, it went away, it went away. It went away, yeah, see that, ah, sucker. Not this time, but you see how these birds are dangerous, man? They're just here waiting for it, you know? That catfish got it good though, he laughed, that's good. Oh, 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 easy, son. It's on. Oh yeah, it's on. Probably another little shark. Oh yeah, it's another shark, man. Hey, better than nothing. It's thrashing on top here. The bird's waiting for it. It's a shark, dude. I don't, I don't think the bird wants to deal with the shark. Yeah, see, the bird's like, I don't want that one. Oh, it got off. All right, not bad. Uh, a lot of sharks over here today. I, <laughs> I guess there's a lot of sharks here every day. Oh, damn, dude. My dad got a bite. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, it popped. <笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑><笑> Shaolin hook set right here, man. Yeah, this seems to be one of those Atlantic sharp nose that we've been catching today. A lot of sharks in this place. Who would have thought that today would turn out to be a shark type of day, huh? For this Soto, man. Let's see, let's see what we got here. I got a coming front here. My dad said it's not that big, man. Dude is a savage, man. We don't even know if it is a little shark yet. It didn't come up yet, but he's fighting it on my Kodiak 5000. So, I mean, you know, let's see, let's see. It's about to come up. It's about to come up. Oh, yeah. Oh, wait. Wait, is that shark? Dude, it's a catfish. Dude, <laughs> Oh my goodness, dude. This is another type of fish that you definitely don't want to see, man. Freaking gaff top sail catfish right here, man. You get stung by this thing, it's not pretty. This is a nice size one too, look at that. No touch. Yeah, happy goes, man. Definitely got to be careful with those. Oh, 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 rapaz! <laughs> oh, man! Fishing with my dad is the best, man. I'm catching us some more cut bait over here because we're running out of cut bait. The pig fish are around again, so you know, I'm giving them the one rod special. And uh, my dad just got one, I think, one piece of cut bait. Yeah, I think so. All right, this cut bait. Let's see what he got. Maybe another catfish. Let's see, let's see. Dude, needless to say, these sharks and this catfish, right? A lot of people take them as 
trash fish, which is a terminology that I don't like to use, but they fight pretty good, man, especially on your freshwater gear, you know? My dad's using the Kodiak 5000, which is a saltwater gear uh, reel by Casking. But look at that, dude. Look at that band, man, on that rod. Dude, this is no joke. I'm telling my dad, be careful. It's running towards the piling. Damn, it's a big ass catfish, dude. I gotta pull it by the line. I told my dad, if we lose it, we lose it, dude. My dad said, be careful with your fingers. Don't worry about it, dude. I'm the master of the braided line. <laughs> Damn, dude. Damn, dude. I ain't gonna take the hook out of this fish. It's inhaled pretty deep, too. Dude, look at that, dude. Are you, are you for real, man? Look, dorsal fins all up, too. Oh, it's getting pissed. Probably the biggest catfish of the day so far. Bro, gotta be very careful handling these. You know what I'm saying? Damn, dude. That is no joke. My dad is doing a good job here, though. Mm-hmm, I know, I know. I don't know, I just sound a little bit. Oh, it's on. Maybe a shark. Maybe a catfish. Oh boy, at this point we never know now. Well, we'll see, we'll see. Dude, my dad's on too. On something. Double up here on the pier, man. Let's see what we got. Oh, mine's a catfish. Mine is a gaff top sail, boy. Let's see what my dad got. Man, gaff top sail got my cut bait again. Oh, hold on. Yeah. All right. This one got a little bit bloody. I hope this one survives. You know, but time for you to go, fella. Let's see. Let's see. Don't want to go. Yeah, there it goes, gone. <laughs> My dad said it's a small one. Well, if he's not pumping, that means it's not big, man. Let's take a look. He doesn't have the Atlantic sharp nose yet. It may be a catfish, maybe a little shark. Let's see, let's see. Should be coming up soon. Oh, yeah, it's a little catfish. Oh, boy. I'm messing with you, catty catty. Any last words you got, catfish? Probably not, right? So, there you go. Time for you to go back where you belong. Um, okay. Damn, one happy catfish. All right, it's gonna be the last fish of the day. So maybe a little shark, maybe a little catfish. We're going to punch it to the right since it's running to the left. I think it is a little, what is it? It's, I think it's a little shark. Let's take a look here. That was a very weak run too, compared to the other ones that we had earlier today. So. Let's see. Dude, every time I work the beef stick, it just reminds me of Black Tip H, you know? <laughs> oh, bro. <laughs> Sharky 3000, man. Working pretty good here. Yeah, look, little shark, man. Thrashing all over like he's a big guy. All right, we're gonna bring him up soon. Hopefully, he's gonna get unhooked by himself, but if not, just a little Atlantic sharp nose for everyone's reference. All right, let's do this. Flip! <laughs> oh, brother. You were too feisty, that's your problem. Man, too feisty. I just want to take this hook out of you, you see? So you can go back. That's, that's it. That's a beautiful sample. I ain't gonna lie. 
I wish it was a black tip, but it is looking like it is an Atlantic sharp, sharp nose. Yeah, beautiful dots on his body too, great patterns. Some uh, very bad teeth over here, definitely don't want to mess with these. Beautiful eyes, we gotta put it back soon enough. All right guys, final view of the last shark of the day. Check this out now, he's ready to go. We got ourselves here a little Atlantic sharp nose. Just gonna throw him back over here. Dude, feisty guy, he's gone. And this pretty much concludes our day here at the pier. We have been fishing the whole afternoon. It's been pretty exhausting, you know? My dad landed some fish, I landed some fish. Overall, it was a good day. So we gotta start packing up now. I gotta do my outro, I think, at the beginning of the pier. Let's do that. It is the end of the afternoon, about 4.30 p.m. right now. And our Florida Slam 2017 father and son is finally coming to an end. This is the last day. We will not be coming back to Florida again. My dad is right over here. He had a good time throughout the entire series, which was the main objective of the series, you know. I mean, we finished it up with 52 different species of fish right from Florida in six days of fishing. I mean, that is pretty crazy, my personal opinion, okay? I don't know how easily achievable that is, but for me, this is pretty amazing, you know? I made some good memories, and I hope you guys enjoyed this series, you know? I mean, as you guys saw, this whole production, all right, these whole episodes, it has all been very amateurish, right? I tried to keep it as homemade as possible here on the channel, but sometimes when I go out there fishing for YouTube, at least I have a plan in my head, you know? I go out and I think, man, this is what I want to film for today, and this is going to be the main idea of the video. For this entire series here on Florida, I really didn't think about that, you know? It, it, was, it was kind of my vacation time with my dad so i hope you guys enjoyed the video i hope you guys enjoyed the entire series we're going back to philadelphia my dad is at what 20 or 30 species of fish right now since he came from this country so i mean the florida slam series may be over but we will still work on how many species he will be able to catch before the end of the year okay thank you so much for watching all these videos guys i truly appreciate it we will be back to some good old philadelphia videos the tundra all right soon enough thank you so much tie lines guys i'll see you guys next time fish on oh yeah come here oh another little guy very small though oh yeah on the teaser another one on the teaser dude crushing the teaser wow this one's like super small though